I had lots of clients and students who were chaotic in their orientation of life. They didn't know what to do, and they didn't know what to do about not knowing what to do. It's like, I don't know what to do with my life, and I don't know what to do about my ignorance. And my, uh, my reaction to that, in some sense, wasn't exactly the reaction of a, a clinician, because not a typical clinician, because typical clinicians are liberal Protestant in their fundamental orientation, and they tend to think of psychological development as something like self-actualization, right? It's really a self-development process, but I, I, that wasn't my, my observation, partly in, influenced by the developmental psychologist Jean Piaget. I had a more communitarian view of human development than that, and my observation was that most people find the, the cardinal meanings in their life not as a consequence of the development of their self, whatever that is, but in service to other people, in, in the adoption of responsibility. You know, because you're told, be responsible, and it's a finger-wagging thing again, you know, that if you were a good person, you'd be responsible, you'd do your duty. But no one ever says, well, because that's where you find the abiding meaning in your life, and you need that meaning to sustain you through suffering. And that's definitely the case. You know, I was very ill for a number of years, and a lot of what got me through that wasn't my own special nature.